is Mario Draspopoulos. I am an associate professor and the program coordinator of the Bachelor of Engineering in Computer Engineering, which I'm going to talk to you about. Before looking into the details of the program, let's start by posing a fundamental question. What really is computer engineering? Computer engineering is actually considered a branch of engineering that integrates electrical and electronic engineering and computer science. Practically, computer engineers are electronic engineers with extra computer science knowledge and skills. In other words, they can be considered as computer scientists with extra knowledge on hardware. Generally speaking, computer systems have these days expanded in almost all areas of our lives. This includes our work environment, our car, in medicine, in the industry, in robotics, in telecoms, and many, many others. Typically, modern systems are an integration of various devices like sensors, actuators, microcontrollers, or microprocessors, as well as the software that drive and control these devices. In the context of computer engineering, not only engineers focus on how these devices operate on their own, but also on how they integrate into the largest picture to come up with something useful that makes our life easier. Computer engineers are the specialists who deal with this integration into what we call today a smart system. This means that computer engineers are involved, amongst others, with the design of individual microcontrollers, microprocessors, personal computers and supercomputers, uh, networks, robotics and electronic circuit designs, as well as software programming and development. The discipline includes much variety, with work available in diverse fields like computer systems, information technology, software engineering and development, telecommunications, computer networks, electronics and robotics, industrial engineering, and various others. It gives you knowledge and skills to explore other employment opportunities in your life, even a career switch, if at some point you decide that something attracts you more than engineering. These include skills in mathematics, in statistics, in programming, in project management, which you can apply in professions like accounting, banking, business management, etc. Computer engineering is indeed a highly researched area, either in the traditional areas of computer architecture and networks, as well as in modern evolving areas like the Internet of Things and robotic systems. Additionally, it is an area with huge impact on the society. Everybody these days has at least a few computerized devices on them and uses or interacts with many others during their daily life. It is also likely that many of those computer systems run on their own and make your life easier, like transport systems, robotic systems, medical systems, smart systems, etc. Very importantly, computer engineering offers you job security. It is considered one of the most employable fields of studies worldwide. The discipline gets bigger and wider day by day, and new opportunities arise all the time. There are so many great opportunities to work worldwide around the world, but also starting your own business could be a great choice for you. As I said, computer engineering is a highly researched area, therefore becoming a researcher might also be a great option. In this slide, we see some popular career options for computer engineers, like computer hardware engineers, computer system integrators, information technologists, the ITs, uh, network and communication engineers, computer security and cybersecurity experts, robotics specialists, software engineers, software developers or programmers, data analysts, uh, electronic engineers, pro project managers, entrepreneurs, researchers, and various others. So, if you cannot make up your mind whether an electrical and electronic engineering degree or a computer science degree is what you really like the most, or which one of the two is the most appropriate for you to study, then a computer engineering one might be the most appropriate option for you as it sits exactly in the middle and it is a great combination of the two. Now, let's talk about the reasons why you should come to Ukland Cyprus to study computer engineering. The program is validated, accredited, and internationally recognized. 
It is validated by both the Quality Assurance and Higher Education agencies in Cyprus and in the United Kingdom. This enables us to give a double award at the end, one from UCLAN Cyprus and one from the Mother University in Preston, as if you were studying there. Very importantly, the program has been built according to the requirements for accreditation by the Institution of Engineering and Technology. This gives an international recognition to the program. The program also includes modules that allow you to get prepared to take professional exams for Cisco CCNA certification, as well as for Linux Professional Institute certifications. Based on the CCNA version 7, which is the latest CCNA certification framework, uh, the program includes specific modules that are either fully aligned or partly aligned with these certifications. Regarding the intermediate modules, CCNA1 and CCNA2, CCNA1 being the introduction to networks and CCNA2 being the switch routing and wireless essentials, we have full alignment. Regarding the advanced modules, CCNA3 that is, Enterprise Networking, Security and Automation, we provide partial alignment. For CCNA certifications that have full alignment with the program, students must only take the certification exam, whereas for partial alignment, stu students need to, to complete some additional hours of Cisco training, which are also offered on campus, before they take the certification exam. All these certification exams, they are delivered on campus. Specific modules of the program are aligned also with the LPI, Linux Essentials Professional Certification. Finally, the program is recognized by the Cyprus Professional Body EDEC, which means that all our graduates qualify to register either as electronic engineers or computer engineers or both. We are convinced that we have a modern and attractive program. It aims to provide a comprehensive overview of all the topics related to computer engineering, allowing the students to develop a holistic knowledge in the field and enable them to work or further specialize in those topics once they graduate. Emphasis is put on highly researched and highly employable areas. These are the computer hardware, the robotic systems, and communication networks. In terms of teaching and learning, this includes theory and much of practical work to equip our students with the needed skills to make them competitive in the job market, whether this market is the industry, the commercial sector, academia, and or research sector, and so on. A few words about the structure of the program. The program is four years long. The first two years are common for all the students. Uh, and from year three onwards, students make choices depending on their chosen focus area. In year one, uh, we aim to make a smooth transition from high school and equip the students with the fundamental knowledge and necessary skills in mathematics, programming, and engineering principles. This includes electrical engineering theory, electronics, programming, calculus, algebra, and discrete mathematics. Uh, students also get to develop their academic and research skills uh, required to succeed in their studies and also recognize the multidisciplinary aspect of engineering. In year two, students study specialized topics relating to computer engineering like uh, analog and digital electronics, instrumentation, networks, computer security, and physics. In year three, students apply the knowledge they gained in previous years to understand the operation, the design, and also analyze systems like digital systems and microcontrollers, operating systems, computer architectures, robotic systems, signal and control systems, electronic systems, networks, security, and also advanced programming. This is the point where they start making the appropriate module choices based on their chosen specialization area. Year four, is the specialization year. It aims to uh, equip the students and make them understand to design and analyze systems on their chosen specialization focus area. It is also the year where they develop their project management skill and also their engineering independency by carrying out their final year project on their own. They also develop professional skills and study topics which will be very useful for their later on career. These include topics in standardization, financial issues, business development, business management, standards, ethics, employability, and various others. Here we see graphically the structure of the program. 
Most of our modules are year long. That means that they start in September and then finish in May. In year one, all the modules are compulsory for all students. Whereas in year two, most of the modules are compulsory with one free elective. Students can choose from a pool of engineering optional modules or even choose a module from any other program in the university. In year three, students start to focus on their specialization area by choosing specific modules. Three of the modules are compulsory. These are the digital systems, computer architecture and operating system, whereas they have to choose four others according to their focus area. There are modules which are recommended for specific specialization areas, but students can make a free selection if they choose to. In year four, three modules are compulsory. These are the final year project, the engineering professionalism, and the microcontroller systems, whereas students need to choose three more modules based on their focus area and the choices that they have made in the previous years are as there might be prerequisites. We consider the practical experience an important and integral component of our students' future employability. Therefore, the program emphasizes on the development of students' practical skill set in addition to providing them the required theoretical knowledge. In this context, all the modules include practical work in modern high-tech laboratories for students to have a unique hands-on experience which helps them to better understand the theory which is presented in class. This develops their logical, critical, analytical, and technical skills in a way that they can study, uh, design, implement, evaluate, and test, and also apply engineering solutions. This is the reason that uh, Euclid Cyprus is the only university in Cyprus that offers a Bachelor of Engineering rather than a Bachelor of Science in which significant emphasis is put on the development of practical skills that engineers should possess. In addition to this, and in order to bring the students closer to the industry and the real world, the university offers and facilitates industrial placements and internships for the students, usually during the summer break, to help them broaden their practical experience and consolidate their learning, as well as establishing a professional network which can provide them with significant advantage in their early career development. In addition to that, an optional industrial placement year is offered uh, at the end of year three. Students can choose to take a year out and be placed in an industrial environment to gain practical and professional experience and then come back and finish their final year. To summarize a few advantages of the program, as with all programs at Euclid Cyprus, our graduates have the benefit of receiving a double awarded degree that means a degree from our parent university, UCLAN UK, and a degree from UCLAN Cyprus. Both degrees are accredited by the UK Quality Assurance Agency and also the Minister of Education in Cyprus, respectively. This provides an additional advantage to our graduates who hold a degree of international recognition. Also, through our strong collaboration with the parent institution, the Euclid UK, we offer our students a British educational experience enhanced with a Cypriot environment and culture. The program emphasizes on developing the practical skill sets of the students in addition to allowing them to gain and develop a holistic and comprehensive theoretical know-how in the, all the fields in computer engineering. It also provides the opportunity for further specialized knowledge and practical skills in specific highly marketable areas, such as robotics, computer networks, and computer hardware. It is also recognized both locally and internationally by the Cypriot local professional body, the ETEC, and fulfills all the requirements for accreditation by the Institution of Engineering and, St and Technology. There are also lots of opportunities for industrial placement and internships du either during the summer or for a full year at the end of year three. There are also opportunities to participate in international placements or internships through the EIS the program. This is a unique opportunity for students to get international experience, see how everything applies in real life, realize what they're really interested in establish networking, which might come in handy when they graduate. The program also employs real problems and scenarios from the industry from multiple domains. This is achieved through industrial visits or guest lectures by industry professionals. 
all permanent staff at Uplan Cyprus is PhD qualified and undergo training to become fellows of the Higher Education Academy of the United Kingdom. And all associate lecturers either hold a PhD degree or have several years of professional and industrial experience. Finally, another unique advantage is, the advantage is that there is opportunity to participate and carry out activities in research and industrial projects of the university, even beyond the curriculum, and also engage in various other extracurriculum activities like participation in competitions, conferences, events, and many others. Thank you very much.